Hello, friend. Beechard Moorfield here. What do you say together we make it a great day? Ralph Waldo Emerson said this, Do not follow where the path may lead. Go instead where there is no path and leave a trail. Perhaps it's time for us to show a bit of pioneer spirit in our life. It's, it's easy to go where other people have gone. I've said of men like my father-in-law who was in ministry for over 40 years. Uh, he's, he's home with the Lord now. I've said of other men who've gone even before him like Wigglesworth, like Charles Finney and others. They blazed trails of ministry where men like myself have been able to walk super highways. At the same time, there are still places of ministry where trails need to be blazed. One of them is in the arena of technology. It's, it's all around us. And, and in many respects, Christians have fallen short of the mark of really you taking advantage of all that is before us. But what we need in our hearts, what you need in your heart today, is an attitude that while you are thankful for the trails that have been blazed before you, you also need to be aware that there are people coming along behind you. And we need to broaden their perspective. We need to lift their views to a higher horizon. How do you do that? You do that not by just continuing to walk and go in the easy route where everyone else has, but begin to think and begin to dream how can you blaze a trail in your life that becomes a pathway someone else can follow with greater ease and then take it to higher expectations. Once again, do not follow where the path may lead. Go instead where there is no path and leave a trail. Someone once said to me, you know how you can tell who the pioneers are? And I asked, well, I'm not sure. And he said, you can tell the pioneer because he's the guy with the arrows in his back. Well, there might be somebody shooting at you while they're out there. But I, can I tell you a secret? There'll be people shooting at you when you run into four-lane highway. Somebody wants what you have. Somebody's envious of you. Don't worry about that. Just get out there and choose in your life to make your life what God wants it to be, what you dream it to be. And then when you do, you blaze a trail. Don't go where the path may lead, but go where there is no path and make a trail for others to follow. You can do that today. It may start in a small way, but you can do that. And doing that, make it a great day.